Why do they call it Spirit Moon? I don't know, Bern, but I always thought it was a good name for the first moon of the new year. That is Pepe Pe Bon Bon. Rabbit stew. Rabbit stew. Oh, well, stew might be a little generous since it is mostly rabbit, but I found some carrots and some onion up at the monk's place. I don't know why you insist on calling that the monk's place. Well, it pleases me to think of him as a monk, living up there alone by the creek and communing with nature. Oh, his house was built as a temple to nature. Oh, the open spaces, the windows that let the sun shine in. Oh, it was simple, elegant, and functional. Oh, I imagine him sitting there meditating like a Franciscan monk. <laughs> So the, the monk managed to keep carrots? Oh, under the floor, covered in sand. They're cold, but not frozen. Really? Hmm, smart monk. People often just left vegetables like carrots in the ground and covered the rows over with straw or hay and harvest them as they need. Well, if he had done that, they would have been gone a long time ago. So it's a good thing for us, he knew the sand trick. Mm. You know, his place might make a good greenhouse. In that corner with all the glass where he meditated. Rabbit! Oh, it was a good size too. Mm. A burn, if you could find a gun. No, I'm looking, Elena, every place I check for a gun, though I'm not sure I really want to find a gun. Or a rifle. Oh, I could get me a deer or a moose. Oh, getting a moose would mean having meat all winter and not having to check dozens of traps in the hopes of getting one or two skinny hairs. Oh, don't denigrate the poor skinny hair. It was generous of him to step into your little noose. Snare. <laughs> 